hello everyone so today we are going to update this uh, ai driven car system and the car race system and this customization everything in the same project that we have worked on over multiple episodes into unreal engine 5.3 so here this is a preview of the customization system and we can apply these colors and start the race now in the race you see the changes are reflected so and also you can see this ai driven cars are looking fine so we originally worked on this in 5.0 then so we kept updating now we are going to update in 5.3 so uh, the reason that i wanted to cover this in a this in a separate episode is because in the structure of the vehicle system in 5.3 is a little bit different from the structure that we have in other in previous engine versions so because of that if you just try to update the project without uh, making any changes into the car blueprint you might run into some problems so Today we are going to address those problems and properly update the system to use uh, to work properly in Unreal Engine 5.3. So the cars are a little aggressive here because I have programmed this to be worked as a race game so that's why they are not uh, much concerned about getting into collisions and stuff. So yeah, let's work on this today. So this is the full tutorial series that I worked on on this project and you can download all the updated project files of this project and also previous projects, previous versions of this project and also any other project that I have covered in my channel in the Patreon page. So there are over 1700 videos and you can download any project files for uh, for any of those videos. So feel free to check it out. That would help me to continue what I do in my channel. So let's get back to the tutorial now. Okay, so this is the project I have created in Unreal 5.2. So here it starts like this in the garage map start race and like this. so everything works fine here AI guys are also working so the thing I want to resolve here is uh, actually I want to make this work with 5.3 also. Uh, the reason is because in 5.3 we have a little bit different structure into this uh, vehicle, wheeled vehicle component. So here this AI car is directly a child of sports car phone and sports car phone is a child class of wheeled vehicle phone. But in 5.3 it's a bit different let's create a new project with the vehicle project vehicle example in 5.3 so this is 5.3 here i'll choose this folder seven ai cars 5.3 and select the vehicle project and create now here you see version is 5.32 and here still we don't have sounds in the example but that's fine but i think the vehicle is more stable compared to before okay so now where is the world settings it's 
sports car power. So this is the sports car phone that we have and it's it doesn't have any code here because this is a child class of vehicle advanced phone which is this one right now in previously this is a but this vehicle advanced phone is a child of wheeled vehicle phone so i want to use this vehicle advanced pawn instead of directly using wheeled vehicle pawn as in here so how shall we do this Let's go about this mm -hmm. i'll migrate these two maps oh yeah like this and here i will just select this skeletal measures Control rig six asset these things because I think I have the same things in the target project. I'm going to migrate the code that I developed into here. So and I think it's safe to leave everything else. And okay. Now I'll select the icons a five point three content folder. Um, should have closed the other project first maybe but anyway it's too late now okay migration complete let's check here seems like everything is here if I try to play okay we get errors Hmm. Oh, this is not migrated properly. All right, let me close it then. Migrate this again. Okay, migrated. Let's try and open it again. Okay. Here now let's see. Here it goes, a spot couple. Okay, no more errors, but we have some warnings. Let's first see if this has to work. This seems to but yeah, input is not working for the player. So the inputs should, are not working because hmm, this is still directly child classed from the wheel vehicle pump. But here we have vehicle advance. So I think we should reparent this one. Sports car phone class settings. Vehicle at fast bar and compile. Oh, we have an error. This name is already used. Let's I call it one. Okay, and uh, nitrous. So we were using input actions, but this one is using enhanced input. So we should remove the existing things from the child class, otherwise they would be redundant. So this throttle, set throttle, where do we set throttle? Move forward. Here. 
Oh no, we have some extra stuff here going on. So directly removing this will not work. So we can replace this with either throttle. Press one. Let's refresh this. Okay. Okay. And this is more right. It only the uh, what it only does is set in steering input. Mm. So this IA steering does the same. So I don't think we have to override that. And handbrake. Here uh, this wheel vehicle phone, a vehicle advanced phone, already have brake lights. So yeah, that also not required. Right. Look right. This is set relative rotation and add local rotation. Here we have this two somehow i think we can just get rid of this part as well switch camera oh here we have toggle camera reset car reset do we have anything else here Interrupt angular moment. No. Okay, this part is also not required. So the only remaining one is uh, this input action. Yes. So nitrous. Um, why don't we add another one? IA break. Let me just duplicate this. IA. Nitrous oxide. Well, that's not a one axis, it's just a digital hole. So we need to add this to IMC default mapping by a NOS. And key shift. Do we have shift here? Just here, anywhere. No, so we are going to use shift. All right, now all good. What's this yeah here I A no S I pressed released so I'll use started and completed or cancel What's this? Pass by reference. Why is this pass by reference? Um, not sure. I can't disable that either. Right. Anyway, let's now test.
I think I I am missing setting up input component. Hmm. Let's check the player controller. Oh, okay. Here we need to have the mapping context added. So that's why our inputs were not working. So maybe when I migrate, this was overridden. So add map pin. No, we need to first get enhanced and put local player subsystem add map in context imc default compile no which work yeah. oh it is working What about the AI characters? Are they doing okay? Seems so. Yeah. They're also going fine. <laughs> One is already fit. Let's skip them back and see if we can get him on track. No, we can't. Okay, so things are working, but why was I able to move before go APS? Uh, I think that's because of this. Here I have this uh, enhanced input action throttle layer and also here. But here I block if movement is enabled. Only if I passed it power, I allow add in any kind of a throttle input but that part is basically not here so we might have to remove this from here or oh, let me just keep it like this just in case we need to restore Now I can't move unless go at this. Oh, I missed it. Check that. Uh, that's fine. I'm not racing for real. So yeah, now everything is working in 5.3. Another thing you should notice is here if we are using the other vehicle this off-road car along with this project since i have removed disconnected here the off-road car will not have the moment input so you would basically have to copy this and re uh, uh, paste it into the other car which is this one yeah you will have to do it like this if you're planning to use that also so yeah now that's all i was planning to do for today now if you have the ai driven cars that is working in 5.3 so thanks for watching as always updated project files will be available here for download in patreon page link would be in the description below and see you in another episode goodbye